Today we are going to be talking about the Home Multimedia Center from Merlin. This is like the name says, basically a centralized multimedia center for all your media. Um, it can store 1500 films, 400,000 photos and 600,000 songs. That means that it has about 3000 GBs of storage. Aside from that it has other really neat features like it has bit, built in BitTorrent which means that you can da download files directly into it through the Wi-Fi that is also built in or through a LAN cable because it has a LAN port as well that makes it ex extremely convenient aside from that it has full HD support and uh, you can also play 3D movies in from it now let's see what is inside this is what it looks like from the inside. So, pretty compact and it looks extremely sturdy. You can see from the back, it has an HDMI uh, port and it has a LAN port. And uh, which means that you can also connect it to your to other devices. Antenna over here means that it has Wi-Fi support, so um, you can transfer all your files in it from your laptop or your computer or whatever. And like I said, uh, because of the BitTorrent client that is built in, you can have your files transferred directly into it, controlling it from your TV. So these are the okay. So you have your remote and your AC adapter, your audio video cables, your HDMI cable and your LAN cable. So this is the instruction manual. It comes with it and in it you will have all the information that you could possibly need on how to operate this home multimedia center so you have your package list your you have a section for first time usage for setting up setting it up and everything we are going to show you how to set this thing up i have already connected the power adapter to the back we are going to show you how to set this thing up. I have already connected the power adapter to the back with the HDMI cable and plug it into your TV, into the TV's HDMI port and then start. So this multimedia center is great because the thing is that all the media that you can possibly have, everything from your songs to your MP3s to your videos, can be stored in one place directly. Meaning that multiple laptops and computers can connect to it and load all of their media into one centralized location. So, Connected the HDMI port, cable coil. Now we use the remote and we switch this on. The light will go from red to blue and then show a loading screen. So when you connect your um, home multimedia center to your TV, this menu will appear and it will load according to the amount of media that is already in the system. If you have a lot of files or if it's full, then it will take about 20-30 seconds and uh, or less according to the amount of media. So what you have over here is if you have different menus, you have your favorites, you have in which you can load all of the stuff that you watch constantly um, or regularly and then you have your file manager which has all your all the stuff, all your storage in it. So your HDD, your hard drive, or your stuff from your network, MP and NFS. Okay. So in your menu, 
can go up to your movies category and all the movies are already loaded. We have three movies over here. So just click play. Click on OK and then the movie comes up. Years from now we're gonna ask them, who are you when they took over the bus? As you can see, the picture quality is really clear because it has full HD, so it plays in 1080p. And uh, aside from that, uh, you can play 3D movies in it as well because it has uh, 3D format capability. Um, what we do is that now we will go into the setup, and you can see all of the different settings that are available for this home multimedia center. So then you have your system settings, your audio settings, your video settings, your network settings, and this links. Uh, if you go into your system settings, you can see that you can change the language, you can change the text, the time, you can uh, format your hard drive directly from here. You can change the wallpaper and you have multiple options for anything that you could possibly think of. If you go into the audio settings, then uh, you have your preferences, night mode, you can have surround sound, you can have lip sync. In your video settings, you can change the aspect radio, uh, ratio, you can change it to support HDMI automatically or manually. You have your plasma mode, your deep color, and your screen size as well. So in conclusion, the uh, Home Multimedia Center from Merlin is actually a very, very useful product because all your files can be stored in one place and uh, you do not need to go through the hassle of transferring things from one place to the other or anything like that. Everything can be done over the internet. Um, so we saw how to set it up, how to operate it, and what it does. Next week we'll have another product.